Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol JDST. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30 minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. Did this analysis several times last week, so that is where this green line annotation here is coming from, and that also uh, is where the first update needs to be made. So this level here was an area of support here at $1.41, and there is a foundational rule in charting which states, when levels of support are broken and closed below, they tend to act as resistance. So because the price is now well below that level, that'll now be the near-term area of resistance where if there is any sort of attempted stabilization and then you know movement back to the upside, $1.41 now gonna be public enemy number one. That'll need to be broken up above. So keep a close eye on that. Uh, like I said, in the, in the near term, if there is gonna be any sort of a, a movement back to the upside. Yeah, up around $1.50-ish area. I mean, that is a level of resistance, but my core point here is that uh, it's a little premature to be talking about those levels until the price can at least you know get up above that uh, initial level, which again, right there at the $1.41 mark. Now, as far as areas of support are concerned, the key level, which to give some credit or credit's due, you would wanna see it hold above that area, and it did indeed hold above that level, and that sits right here at $1.30. You go back here through the history of things and you can see that $1.30 acted as support, acted as support, and then once again acted as support. So like I said, $1.30 definitely one of those areas that you wanna see you know, continue to hold strong. So keep a close eye on that and you know, gotta kinda of just sit back and see uh, whether or not the bulls are gonna be able to muster up enough strength to, to maintain that area. But uh, if they are not though, that's where things get interesting because the next level of support, really not until all the way down here at $1.22, am I saying that it's gonna drop straight down there? I'm not saying that, my point is that there's just quite a bit of open space here that could present and create that much more downwards pressure to it. So we'll see what happens with it. Only Monday, so still four days left this week, so we'll see if the price can try to get things turned around or not. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too, good, way too good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.